Hello, Phantom Nova here, and welcome back to my channel and another episode of Planet Zoo, where we are playing in, um, playing franchise mode, and we are in our zoo, Legacy Theta. Let's see if they're gonna... If she's going to get pregnant. Yay. Um, good, good, good. So we're cycling through them. Um, and I bet this is, yeah... Our cheetah is stressed. Okay, going back up. Good. Um, I did put a um, quiet sign in um, because when I got into the game, both of the cheetahs were stressed. So, we can't have that. But, um, so let's get back to it. So, last time we worked a little bit just on finishing... Um, the steps up and getting this um, but the main thing was we put in our cheetahs over here and we put in our um, Komodo dragons over here um, so what we need to work on now ooh, look at you run um, what we need to work on now is going to be um, uh, the Goliath Beetles. None of them are pregnant. So we got rid of them. Does she already have her? Well, where's her? Uh, was that one she had three so she had a um, albino one and then two others awesome so three Um, and also, just looking at our finances, we're doing pretty good. Um, when we cut out last time, I was able to increase the um, zoo prices, uh, the ticket prices, so that has helped dramatically. None of our other females have gotten pregnant yet. Um, so what we want to do... Hmm, I'm almost wondering if we should switch this out for... Um, for um, solid so that they don't gather down here and they go up here. Um, I don't know. We'll see. Um, but what we do want to do right now is 
or what I want to do is I'm going to put two um, Komodo dragon's about to mate. That's good. Let's see, what do we got? What do we got? Low welfare. Because you're stressed, but... Some more research done. Titan beetles, we're gonna go and put you in. Eastern blue tongue, put you in. Western diamondbacks. Let's see what else we got. Female's not great. I only want to do another snake. All the turtles are male. Let's pause it for a second. do a spider but I don't really have any good spiders available I mean I guess I could go with the 
Brazilian salmon pink tarantula. I guess that's what we'll do. That's done. So we need to do what? It should be the same. Yeah. And on the other side, it should be one, two, and three. Well, look, so that's fine. Well, let's go on and name these while we're here. Western, Diamond, Back, Rattlesnake, and this one, Brazilian, Salmon, Pink, Tarantula, and flip over here, let's do this one. Eastern blue tongued lizard. Got that, that, that. Temperature is good and should be one, two, and three. Put four animals, the cheetahs. So all of theirs. Must be fine. That's the first time I've put put a bunch of exhibit animals in and didn't have to change any of their habitats. Um okay, let's do let's go and get Them put in over here as well. Oop. We do need to get some conservation boards put in too. Um, okay. We've got that in. We've got some decorating to do. Um, over here, um, I think we'll put some more shops in over here. Um, yeah, shops. So, let's put in a, I don't even know what we have, Gulpy Energy, just a memento, Gulpy Slush. Ice cream, information, and a chief beef. Okay, so let's do Looney Balloons beside here. And then over here, yeah, we're good. Okay. Let's do a Pip Shot Water. And. A major fries. I think they need to be raised up a little bit, but that's fine. It should make a deal, uh, make a difference. Okay, so got that, got that. Um, guest facilities. We do need to put in some donation bins over here. Um, and we actually need to put trash cans down everywhere, too. But let's just start with a few here. Um, we got some there. 
some down there. We're going to put some here. We got some on that end. Okay, so that takes care of uh, what I wanted to do in there. I mean, we got to decorate it, but um, that'll come later. Um, I do want to put a an ATM there. That should be good. Okay, we are approaching a thousand guests already. Um, what I wanted to check is just to make sure. Ticket price is good. Ticket price is good. Ticket price is good. What do you think? Ticket price is good. Same for y'all. Y'all are stuck. So if that's ah, oh, the cheetahs are expecting offspring now. Um, let's go over and look at them. That's awesome. Really nice to get some um, some of the big cats in, and another Indian peafowl is about to mate um, with the albino too. That's awesome. And she is pregnant now. Why are you running? Both of them are pregnant. Wow. Okay. That is excellent. They're pregnant, and I actually think the Komodo dragons are pregnant too. Are they? Um, they are. So May of year 11, so just a few more months for you. Conservation rating to 3.5. Um, yeah, so we'll get some conservation boards down when we do a um, beauty pass. Um, I did not realize, but the crocodiles don't mature until age 14. He's eight. So he's barely over halfway. Okay. Working on the cheetahs. We've still got lots of research to do. I don't just want... Ooh, that was... That was some words. Um... Let's go on and put in... Since we are doing okay with money now... Um, let's go on and put in a re another research center. Um, we'll put it over here. Like that. Um... So let's watch him as we put you on the Komodo Dragon. Okay, one albino, two, okay so she only had two, that's still, still fine, uh, but let's see, a gold star, pretty decent jeans, Female, pretty decent genes, but is only a... No, you are a gold. And pretty decent genes. Excellent. Excellent. Um, okay. So what we need to do now is... Or what I want to do for the rest of the episode... And I don't know if we're going to leave the game unpaused because so we ended with 21,000. So that is excellent. I think with having the cheetahs in is what's going to help us maintain um, that positive. Um, so as you can see, I did buy another saltwater crocodile um, because once, um, once they mature, I'm keeping our... Um, <gasps> I didn't realize there was two. Okay. Yellow skinned, gray skinned, and green skinned. Okay. Um, I don't know when that happened, but um, I'm going to keep either her or her. I'm not sure which one. 
um, probably the older one that's going to come of age sooner. Um, we're going to keep them and get rid of the two parents um, to go that away. Um, but what we want to do now is work on the plant coverage in the habitats because we've done nothing for that. Um, so we're going to do that right now um, and then we're going to eventually at some point do some sort of beauty pass for um, for the uh, for the entire zoo um, Um, but what we're going to do is we're going to start with the saltwater crocodiles since they were our first animal. Because they don't require much. Um, let's see. Continent Asia and Oceania. Biomes aquatic tropical. Okay, so what do we got? Some palms. Um, too bad the it's uh, dirt. I mean the ground isn't a little further out. Hmm. I think we'll put a tree on each side. Okay. Um, don't really want any trees. Are these meant to grow underwater? I don't know. I don't know. Underwater temple plants. See, underwater doesn't count. as if it was there and fell in. Okay, so we're going to put in some reeds along the edge.
here. Okay, they're getting to the edge of their um, plant capacity. So let's just put a little bit of bamboo up there. And that's all we can do. Okay, so that takes care of them. We might eventually add some rocks, but for now, that's what we're going with. Okay, and then for you, Asia, we got Asia Tropical, so let's take off Aquatic and Oceana, and then we need Grassland and Temperate. Okay. So we have to be very selective of the of what we choose because we technically are on the roof. Um, I don't think bamboo would hurt. would be great but since we are on a roof we can't particularly have um, a tree they can't have a lot of coverage either Some of them. I'm going to save these for the other side. Bracken. Okay. And then what we're going to do over here is like in this corner. Um, Okay, we can't get it yet, but we can't get it with the filters on, so let's reset the filters, because what we want is not that big. Yeah, not really that big either. I guess let's do the curve. That's sticking out a little bit. So let's switch to the three. And the two. And then... What the one square? There we go. And then what I want to do is, under construction, look for wood. What we want to do is find something, something. What are we searching for?
something like that. And we put it over here too. And if I, by chance, I throw like that as well. No, I don't need to select that. Turn it around there. in there we go and then what we're going to do is go back to Asia um, tropical temperate and grassland so what we want to do is tr figure out what we want to put in this area obviously we can't put a lot like that. Maybe we'll go on and just do these. Something like that. Um, I didn't actually check, but hopefully they're fine with them. They are. And they're still good with, they're good on space. I mean, good on the coverage. Um, cause can't really do much more over here without taking up a lot of their space. Um... I mean, we took up 50 square meters with what we did. So, um, that's fine. Did I miss something? Did you just have babies? More babies? Wow, you had four babies too. Pretty good, pretty good too. Yeah, we're great. We're we're, we're um, breeding some excellent females. Um, another one is hungry. So let us call keeper. Okay, so that takes care of two of them. Um, so let's do the cheetahs next. And you should be grassland, Africa, and desert. Okay. Africa and desert. Okay. Um, we maybe go back to all of them. Baobab. I really like this tree, but it's so big. That should work, because they had plenty of area. Yeah, that, that'll that be fine. Um, and then what else do we want to do? Just a couple other trees. I think that'll do it on that, and then we'll go, we'll do some of these just in a couple patches and what else we got 
some African daisies. Do a little bit of them. Can't do a whole lot more. Okay, and so that gets them done. She laying down. Oh. Coming up on, and she's a five star. But coming up on your, um, she's coming up on to give birth. What are we missing? Education and marketing. Can't do but so much marketing even now. But should be good with that. Okay. So let's go on over here. I think we're good to go on and let it play now. Um, so we just have them left. So Asia. Grassland and Tropical. Asia. Grassland and Tropical. Okay, let's see. What do we want to put in yours? Not that. Let's do the Weeping Willow. Them. And then let's do one of them right at the edge. Oh, let's see what else we got. Um, I think we will put some bamboo in, but let's let's see if there's any other. Trees? No, as I don't want to put a baobab tree over here. Uh, but let's put one of them there in the middle, and we got some coconut palms. We'll do a few around, a few there. Cheetah is about to have offspring. Wow. Okay, let's let's pause it so that we can finish um, finish the Komodo dragons and head over to see the cheetahs. Okay, and then what else? What else? What else? Oh, they have the really short bamboo. I thought we had other bamboo, but let's put that tree You know, I guess they don't have bamboo. No, there's a bamboo tall bamboo. Okay, 
So we finally got some plant coverage in their exhibits. We've still got, we're still going to put some others around here as well. But let's get over here and play while we find her. Both of them are five, st I mean, yeah, five star. But let's see our, hopefully we'll have a couple babies, because I think, let's, since she hasn't had them yet, let's just look real quick. So one to five, it'd be great if she had five, but um, even if we can just get, um, if we can get a couple, that would be really good. One, two, three, four. She had four. That's that is awesome. Um, what I wanted to look at was rating. Okay, so we have a female, pretty decent. Female even better. Male with okay. And female with really nice genes. And let's just verify that the babies can't get out anywhere. They shouldn't be able to, but you know, if they. I didn't think they could jump on top of here, but um, I wouldn't put them. Wouldn't put it past them. So, but that is awesome. So we had four cheetah cubs. So that is amazing. We've said hi to all of them. Conservation rating is up because we had cheetah babies. Is it really about to snow? It sure is. Okay. Before it does that, I know the cheetahs and Komodo dragons cannot be in cold. And actually, I don't think the... I don't think the peacocks... I, I mean, I know the peacocks don't want to be in cold either. But let's just verify. Yeah. They're, they're inching below their what they want. Uh, let's just verify Komodo. So set, set at 60 for both of them would be fine. And Cheetah. Yep, set at 60 for all of them would be fine. So let's go in and do that. Um, and they are going to just be visible because... What is this set at? 86. I'm thinking 60 will be fine. Okay. So then what we're going to do is going to copy it and paste it. If you copy it, paste it once, or not, if you do control D, and um, it is going to need to be on the glass, I think. Um, let's see if we put it up here and just do it once exit out and then go back and do it It maintains whatever degrees you set it at um, If you go and just copy And if I was to place it again, it's gonna do it. It's gonna revert it back to the original Okay. Um, actually what I want to do is copy it and then exit um, nope, see, I just did it, and it reverted that back. But if I go here, and place it again, Oh, we 
probably need to put a water regulator over here. I think the Komodo dragons will be covered in the other, uh, with the other one. But I know this one will not be covered. So let's go in and do that real quick. Put it in that group. Um, 68 is fine. Path. Boom. Okay. So that takes care of that and that. And then let's just verify. Not what I wanted. Um, oh, so it will not reach over there. That's great. Did not want to put in another one. But. Come on. You can do it. There we go. And then let's copy you over and get you put in here real quick. And with this, it, we're going to probably call it an episode. Um, I am going to let it unpause and let these heat up, melt the snow, make sure that everything is set. those are in so let's go on and unpause it and hopefully those will be down in time that it doesn't get they don't get covered in snow yes they are down just in the nick of time and they are good everything is good there's a little bit of snow there which I think is considered to be inside. What we'll do is... Well, if I could put it in the center, we'll put it as if it's right there. That'll cover that. Okay, and let's see, because there is snow there. Let's see if the... Wow. Are there any out? Let's just look. No. None of them are out. They're all here. That's, that's adorable. So we have two baby albino ones. And one's gold star and one's silver. I mean, one's gold and one's silver. That's awesome. Are any of our others pregnant? I don't think so. No. Hopefully we'll get some. But what I wanted to look was... So there's 1% snow. It's from where it's on top of their shelter. They don't like it, but it's not that big of a deal but what I'll do is I'll go on and just put that there that'll heat that and get rid of that and if we look back wait is there more snow that I'm not seeing I mean unless it's counting this which is possible 
Um, I didn't want to put it on the glass, but we're going to just put it on the glass. Okay, did that take care of it? No. Well, 1% uh, snow for just a short time. I think we can deal with that. Because I don't have a clue where it's at, but... Okay, and then our cheetahs are good. They just laying about. A little bit of snow somewhere in there. Ah, right there. that back to where it was and just paste another one and that takes care of that perfect oh something else we forgot yeah yeah still a little bit of snow somewhere but they can can deal with it is we don't have any donation bins over here. We do need to put education boards down because I don't. We have a few up for the saltwater crocodiles, but that's all we have up. Okay, so that takes care of that. Um, lots of snow, but that'll pass pretty soon. But, yeah. Um, let's research. Cheetahs done. Or a little bit more on the cheetahs. That's about done. Okay, I want to train our staff up um, but I can't really do it I'm gonna go and train them up because we need them um, and then I'm gonna train them up and I'll train a few of these that are lower those really just those we're going to do just a couple others I can't train but so many because um, it'll eat into our profits. Um, and I don't want that. So, you hungry. Keeper is in route. Where is our keeper? Um, Okay, so you are heading there. Um, okay, so... Oh, the Titan Beetles. Wow. So one, two, three, and... Takes care of that. Some gold rated ones. Okay, so let's just send them all and see what we got. So we want those. And do we have a gold? Another gold. Eh. Yeah, you should be fine. You are a little older, but hopefully you'll have babies first. Get rid of them, and hopefully our keeper where are you going? Preparing food. Okay. Not really sure why it took you so long, but of course you've attracted protesters. Um, 
research on what. Both of them good. Um, I didn't want to, but we are going to go on and get another... Because um, we've got four habitats. One, two... Six exhibits. So let's go on and do two more keepers. Um, that should be good. Um, okay. So... Yeah, I think it is time for us to call it an episode. Um, but I think I think it's coming along pretty nicely. Um, what we're going to do is fill in this area first before we expand anymore. Um, so we'll put in probably an ex a, a habitat here and one here. Same over here, one here. We may shift these buildings a little bit so that we can get one behind it. But we'll see. Um, I want to do some a beauty pass around some of this that we've already done. Get these done. Um, but yeah, um, this zoo is coming together nicely. So I hope you have enjoyed the episode. Um, until next time, stay safe.